Friday morning, heading to work. Tonight, we are meeting up with Emily and Will, and we're gonna go see... Good morning! It's St. Patrick's Day. Oh, happy St. Patrick's Day, but what are we seeing today? We're gonna see Beauty and the Beast tonight. I'm really excited. So am I. Eric is gonna be excited once he sees it. I'm not gonna be excited once I see it. It's just a, a classic cartoon that should not have been made into a live action movie. But Emma Watson is in it. So? She's amazing. She was amazing in, in, in Harry Potter. What else has she been amazing in? Everything she's ever been in. I'm not saying she's a bad actor. Just... And she's just an amazing person. The other annoying thing is, recently watched the trailer, they're doing a live action movie, The Little Mermaid. Which should not be called The Little Mermaid. It should be called Mermaid. The Little M. Girl Under the Water. Something. Just stop ruining classics. You know, that's not classics. the Little Mermaid movie they're making. They are making... Let me come back in frame. Hi. Uh, I heard that they are... Do you want are... to stay here? Because you walk away and you come back. Yeah, probably. Uh, <laughs> they are making a live action Little Mermaid based on the Disney animated movie. Why? Because they can. No. It's their property and they can do what they want with it. Including no. remake it. You know what? Do a TV show. Because... No, a TV show is not going to... Why would they do a TV Because it's show? crap. It's crap. And they know it's crap. And it's low budget. And it just says crap it's low budget. It's not low budget. They put through a ton of money in it. Oh my god. It looks so bad. You, If you no, haven't I'm seen... Talking, I'm talking about Beauty and the Beast. Oh, it's going to be so bad. The singing, I just don't... Okay, so Eric has this thing where he doesn't think that he likes musicals until he watches them, and then he's like, actually, that wasn't that bad. There's only one musical that I really like, and that is Once. Well, okay, I'm talking modern day musical. Not like Little Shop of Horror and, and um, other musicals. What did you think about Wicked? Wicked, Wicked was good. What did you think about Phantom of the Opera? But I feel like that's what you expect. When you go to a, when you go to a play, mm -hmm. that's... When musicals on I'm pretty sure in a gave movie theater are rave different. reviews to the Book of Mormon. Like musicals at the movies, I don't agree with anymore. I like Grease. I like all those old musicals, West Side Story. But all this new stuff, I just don't care about. So I have a problem with the live on TV musical. I do not have a problem with a high budget movie film musical because that's that makes sense to me but like when they make remake them for tv like they did with the grease live and all yeah, yeah that no stuff. i don't i don't like that Sound stuff. I don't no. Like that stuff no that's not gonna cut it for me the music is just bad the music that's written for not 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 like old and stuff nowadays stuff the music is just does it make you feel better if alan if you knew that alan minkin came back to write all the songs sure, for the new beauty and the beast no no because they're not going to write new songs it's going to be the same songs it's they just Emma add, Watson singing no, the song. No, they had to though. add a couple new ones in. Let's let's see. There was just something so like really pretty about the cartoon one and ridiculous. Now it's just gonna be I don't know. It's I always liked it because she likes to read. It was really funny. Did you see um, how it should have ended? Beauty and the Beast animation. No. Oh my god, it's really funny. So uh, spoiler alert: if you haven't seen Beauty and the Beast or how it should have ended. You ever watch that, that yeah. YouTube channel? They show like the beast comes back, turns into a man, and then he dies because he was stabbed in his kidneys. And the spell didn't say anything about healing wounds. <laughs> so he still died. <laughs> Disagree. I guess I'm gonna wanna enjoy that. So that is my my life today. I'm gonna We're gonna have a and maybe, then we're going out for St. Patrick's Day after we go to the movies. Because we're both Irish. They could maybe think of Irish, too. <laughs> because someone with a last name like Castro is totally top of the morning to you. Yeah. Yeah. There you go. All right. Beauty and the Beast. Then drinking. But I don't want green beer. You don't have to drink green When beer. I was younger, I used to no, I've go had, to the bar. I've, I've had I, used to, I actually beer marched too. in the St. Patrick's Day parade coloring. numerous times when I was younger. It's just food coloring. It doesn't change the flavor. I don't like beer. I know. Maybe if it changed the flavor, I would drink it. 
All right, can we can we go to work now? I need a coffee. But if we go to work, that means the day's almost over, and that means I have to watch Beauty and the Beast. Oh my God! All right, we're going to work. It's like you're gonna be laying on a bed of nails. This is not gonna be. That sounds really comfortable right now. Beauty and the Beast. It's not gonna be like that, dear. All right. You're gonna enjoy it. You're not gonna hate it. Full review, coming soon. Woo! What a day. Um, we got. Oh, Emma has her face painted. Isn't it pretty? Well, you can't. You you turn away too much. There we go. Is that better? Yeah. I don't know how much of an angle I need to make. There you go. Um, so, Beauty and the Beast. It was amazing. It was not amazing. It was amazing. It was Eric amazing. is a party pooper. There was no reason for them to make this movie. Except that it was amazing. It was not amazing. Um, here's my thing. I, I want to ask you this question because I didn't mm -hmm. ask you this. If someone came over to you mm -hmm. and said, I want to watch Beauty and the Beast. Which one would you recommend? I don't know. I would recommend the animation. Okay. There was just something about the animation. There was no reason for this movie to be made. Um, Eric thinks it was a money grab. I think anything that has Emma Watson in it is a plus. And there was singing and there was beautiful. Like the, the dresses were beautiful. The sets were beautiful. Everything was The Beast was really awful. The Beast was no, awful. No, he was not. He was excellent. The, the, CG, the CG looked was excellent. was not excellent. It, it was, was okay. Excellent. They should have used excellent. prosthetics. It excellent. was not excellent. It was very good. It was an okay movie. I give it an eight. An eight is a very high rating for Eric. It's a high rating. A seven, five, eight. Seven, five, eight. It wasn't, it wasn't it great. It was a nine. You, they couldn't change much with this movie. But they added new songs. The Beast song, oh, it was so good. No way. No way. When Belle leaves to go back to the village to save her father, it was really good. I have to look up if it was part of the stage musical or not because it was an excellent song and the whole time I was like, this feels like a stage musical song. It wasn't that good. It was really good. Besides that, we had a new bar open up near us. Yes. The Craftsman. Amazing. Great place. Um, it's an really? Irish bar? Yes. Irish bar. Four, three Irish owners, one British owner. Yep. They were fantastic. They were so nice tonight. There was face painting. Face painting. They. We had lots of drinks. We had a meat and cheese plate. Emily had a Cuban. Yeah, we went with Will Emily. Will had a Reuben. So there were a lot of Ubens going on. A lot of Ubens and a lot of drinks. A lot of drinks. And what was amazing, truly amazing. So it was their very first day being open. It happened to be St. Patrick's Day, which was very fortuitous for them. But we had a lot of drinks. We had a lot of drinks. What was amazing they is us. they comped, which was amazing. Which like. I think it's because we said we were from the. I don't know. I don't feel like they're making any money tonight. No, if they're no. Drinks, because really, I thought our bill was going to be like three hundred dollars. It was going to be over a hundred, easy. I would have said a hundred and twenty. So one, two, three, four. Four of us. We each got like four drinks, and they were fifteen dollars each. Yeah, it was. It was. So that's sixty dollars per person. So what's sixty times four? That's two hundred and forty dollars. Okay. Plus. The food, food. and they, which the meat and cheese plate was twenty five dollars. They charged us just for food. Yeah, drinks were comped tonight because literally we just told the bartender make us whatever you feel like making us. It was it Who, was. He's one of the owners, so he was just like, oh, I'll make you this. He was like, what kind of liquor do you like? I was like, I like bourbon. Yeah, and he bourbon. for as long as we're here, he has customers. Yes. This place. Customer loyalty has just been guaranteed. It was amazing. I Great. feel bad that I didn't give an even bigger tip than I gave. Well, we're, we're going to be going there. Yes. Great night, bad movie, great drinks. No, good movie. Bad CG. Good movie. It was amazing. I really enjoyed it. There was clapping, there was crying. The entire audience, except for Eric, who was going, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. I hate this movie. The yeah. popcorn was good. I don't think you get to talk about this anymore. Because Sa it was amazing. Save your money. Go to the Craftsman. Really good place. The movie was really good. The Craftsman is a fantastic restaurant slash bar. I give the Craftsman a ten. I give Beauty and the Beast. I give a the 7. Craftsman 5. a ten. A, a nine point five because the door is open. It was a little chilly. I like the chilliness. Um, but they also do coffee in the mornings. So literally they're gonna have all my money. Yeah. So maybe it doesn't matter what I paid them today because they're gonna have the rest of my money. 
Um, I think that's going to be it. It's late, guys. One cool thing that I wanted to share with all of you, my painting is going to... <gasps> hey, did my shoes come to ...dramatically me? improve. My shoes came to me. Because today I got some Series 7 paint brushes from Windsor & Newton. Shh, Emma has shoes. So I got some new paint brushes, which it's not going to really improve my painting because that's a technique. But they're supposed to hold paint better. Um, the Windsor & Newton 7 Series 7, I got, I got a number one brush and a number two brush. And I'm excited to try them out. We'll see how it goes. Tomorrow, Saturday, we have a soccer game. I have to go get my bib for the New York City Half Marathon. I also should do a three mile slow. I, I, I know I'm using small as slow, but a three mile slow run tomorrow. Emma's gonna open up her shoes, but we're not gonna go through that today. That's going to be it, guys. I they're, hope- As Eric would say, they're sneakers. They are sneakers, they're not tennis shoes. Tennis shoes. People, people on the tennis east coast. People on the east coast, they're known as sneakers. Other places, they're called as tennis shoes. Emma doesn't play tennis, but that is just me rambling. I hope you guys had a great day, and I will talk to you next time.